Right, hello. What I'm going to be talking about here is basically friends and family. Yes, I know, we all have them. But basically, um, it, it, it's a question that I often think, you know, at times about what should come first. And it's about, you know, um, because times when I've gone out and I wanted to go and see my friend and basically um, she has said that she might not be able to make it all for all the time. And that's because she has to go and see her family as well, and um, it just happens to be that day. And therefore, um, I've been told by some people that f f family should come before friends. It should be that case of, you know, they bring you into this world, why would you not go and see them first over your friends? And I personally don't believe that. I think that um, friends are just as important as family, um, because after all, your family won't be there all, uh, if you're, well, 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 let's just say it depends on who you class, because if you're thinking of your mum and dad, or your aunt, or your uncle, they might well be in, in that year where, in them years where you think, hmm, and how would you imagine that family comes first? Is it because you have to say, oh, cousins, is it whatever you class as that? My age of 28 could be that my mum and dad are, what, 55? Well, my dad's going to be 57 this year. My mum will be 54. So generally, what happens if they happen to be, let's say, in 10 years or in 20 years time, and they and they and they and they leave this world? My age will be what 48. So what do I say to myself? Right, I'm not going to see my friends because my family comes first. Now, does that mean anything? If it's a case of let's say my mum and dad not being in this world so would it mean that I have to say right I'm going to go and see my cousins who are younger than me or I'm going to see somebody who might be in the family who is obviously opposed to that but then when I'm 48 I could have a girlfriend I could be married I don't know so that could be different I just find that t t to me you know friends is something I, I think are important to me and I just think that if I happen to have arranged to go out and see a friend and and uh, obviously if my family wanted me to go out you know if they said to me oh you have to come out and uh, because you can't go and see a friend on this day you've got you've got to go and see family I would say no I, I, I arranged to go and see my friends and they come pretty much before or can come before my family in fact I would make the example I would make the thing of going to see my friend spending the time that needs to be, whether it's, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm meeting a friend, we're going to be there for like, especially if I'm going out somewhere like, on a train trip, if I'm making the um, effort to spend my money that I've saved, and and having to travel from my hometown to go somewhere else to go and see somebody, I should expect that they would see me for that time, rather than say, oh, it's only going to be an hour, it's only going to be two hours. Um, and it'd be not, and it'd be my thing to think that I can do that. And you know, as as been told, you can see your some people can see their family any day of the week. So, you know, but it would be a case of I'd think, well, what if they was able to spend the time? You know, say, oh, I'm going to go see my friend in some other place, and it's going to be that I'm going to get there at twelve o'clock. My train back will be at say five o'clock. So. One, one, two, two, three, two, three, four, 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 that's five hours that I'll be expected to stay with my friend. And they can say, well, there you go. They could say, well, I'm going to see my family after I've, I've seen you. Which works both ways. They get to see me all the time and that. And I just don't think that there's some people out there who have to be heartless about saying, um, family come first. And therefore, um, that if they didn't come and see you, if you went up, to go and see somebody and they didn't turn up because they were going to see a family. Some people say that that's that's not really something that should be you know, you shouldn't have a go at it because they should say the family comes first, they go and see their family and you don't get the say in in that. And I said and I am I'm, I'm like, well what if I was what if we were girlfriend boyfriend? What if I had a girlfriend and I said, I'm coming to see you and they turn around and say, Oh no you can't come see me because my family comes first. That would absolutely be shockingly bad, you know. And I would actually turn around and say, well, 
there's no there's no point in there's no point in us being together because basically um you're not spending enough time with me because you're too busy spending your time with your family and that's the old point that we have to make you know there are sacrifices to be made and you have to do these things you have to see who you can see as, as much as you can had it needs to be and I just don't see how somebody can be so hard to say that even if I had a girlfriend and and like this person said the girlfriend would not come and see you because family come first never mind whether whether she's your boyfriend her family will come first and I'm like you that really just wasn't right and I just think that um it's always the case that family does family always come before friendship that always be the case and I just don't think that is not the case and sometimes I think that with friends you can speak to them about things that maybe you wouldn't speak to your family about you know you're having family problems but you wouldn't go to them and speak to them would you you'd probably say well I'll go see my friend and talk to her talk to her or him about it and that's exactly what I feel so I just don't think there has to be some people out there who think that um, it's all about um, friends or family or whatever. F friend and family are, are almost equal, but it shouldn't be that one overrules the other. And therefore, I just think that family doesn't always come first. Don't always think like that. And especially for sometimes when you've got family you don't get on with. If you don't get on with certain family members, and that why should you put them in, in front of friends, you know? That's another stupid reason you know like people say family should come first and you've got like cousins and aunts and uncles and say whoever you know you might think I don't get along with them and therefore people say but you should make them come first opposed to your friends what if we don't get along why why would I want to do that why would I want to, why would I want to go see somebody I've never seen for like ages because we don't really get along and go ah uh, you see my friend would come before that, definitely, and I always think of my friends, and I've always been, been like that, I've always been that friends are important to me, the people that I know, they are very important to me, and if I want to go see my friends, I expect that they will come and see me, and hopefully spend as much time as we possibly can, and enjoy it, rather than people saying, oh, family comes before you, before you because, you know, that's just stupid, I'm sure you all have your, uh, say on this one and that and um I just like to say that I'm quite 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 privileged to be able to uh you know have some very important friends to me that are special to me and they know who they are and I don't need to really give them a mention because we'll be here all night if I'm mentioning so many of them so there you go that is just the way that I want that's just what I wanted to talk about you know something quite simple and um what are your thoughts on that one so anyway Bye for now.